one fall, making his way to the ring, representing the Alpha Academy from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 202 pounds, Chad Gable. Chad Gable, proven ability to teach and lead as the head of the Alpha Academy. take lightly despite his catchphrases that we've seen this guy deadlift men more than double his size on multiple occasions gable's more than proven he's a legitimate threat in that ring Here he comes, the franchise of WWE. Listen to this place. No one else gets a reaction from the crowd like John Cena. And his opponent from West Newberry, Massachusetts, weighing in at 251 pounds, the greatest of the world. For a long time in his career, John Cena was considered one of the most controversial superstars in WWE history. Yeah, the love him or hate him, you cannot deny the impact that Cena has had on this business. And unless you're burying your head in the sand, you also can't deny that Cena belongs on the sports entertainment Mount Rushmore. And you really have to be at the top of your game when facing John Cena, because we all know Cena always stays at that particular level. Yeah, Cena's not one to take shortcuts, which has earned him a sort of begrudging respect from his opponents over the years. Begrudging is right, Corey, but Cena has proven he has no problem doing things the hard way. On the other side of the ring is a pure machine. Chad Gable considers it a show of wild disrespect for anyone to think they can hang with him from bell to bell. Proceed with caution because Chad Gable's a puzzle that's tough to solve. He laces him up to prove he is unfazable inside that 20 by 20 ring. He's doing a whole lot of gesturing and it could cost him. He'll take things into the ring. Gable on the receiving end. Ouch! When it comes to Cena, we've seen that all the preparation in the world can often end up meaning nothing once you're standing across the ring from him. Corey, what do you think is the actual strategy for standing toe-to-toe -to -toe with Cena? Well, Cole, Cena can sometimes underestimate his opponents. Sure, it makes sense when you've been on top as long as he has, but that's the exact thing that can end up leading to his downfall. So the best course of action is to let him underestimate you. Don't go full tilt just yet. Bide your time, and Cena will leave an opening. John Cena's fired up and wants this crowd to know it. All right, back to it, returning to the ring. Big back body drop. Ooh. Big forearm. Impact in the corner. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Can Gable withstand much more of this? Cena showing that trademark ruthless aggression. And Gable experiencing a true show of sky high. Down with the elbow. And shoulders are down. Two. And Chad Gable powers out. And frustration might be starting to set in. Gable was waiting for it. Ooh, treading all over their opponent. Cena being the aggressor. This is Chad's perseverance getting tested. Dismantling the arm in the corner. 
gotta hurt. That arm's gonna be sore for a while. Could affect all their offense. Face first. Top of that turnbuckle is not where you want to be. Uh oh, from the top. Stop there from the top. He knew that was coming. Side headlock applied. Spinning around, flexing their technical acumen. Boom! And Chad Gable looking for support from the crowd. Neckbreaker! <laughs> Hooked up. <laughs> He's taking some good hits. DDT! And these attacks are spelling nothing but trouble. Ah, look at this. Oh, that can dislocate something. And Cena's starting to falter here. And credit where credit's due. He bided his time and waited for a good opportunity to strike. Cena may have totally underestimated him. Suplex! That is the confidence of John Cena. The confidence you have when you are the face that runs the place. Into that turnbuckle. Solely focused on. Ooh. Gets him with the counter. Dragon screw takedown, not finished yet. Right into a leg lock. Ah, look at this. Just breaking down the opponent. Boom! Slam! With authority. Side headlock applied. Spinning around. Flexing their technical acumen. Shit breaker into a suplex! Great combo. Clearly waiting for that. Cena making clear he has his number. Stop gloating and put your attention back to the match. Cena plans in motion. That's a good job. We got work break. Suplex holding on for another, and why not? Let's get a trifecta. And a big trick by Gable. See this in trouble. See this in trouble. Cover. He wasted no time kicking out there. How on earth could he not keep him down for even one at this point? And we all know how Gable gets when things don't go his way. Hopefully, he can focus on getting the job done instead of complaining about the referee's count. And did you hear the impact of that? And set right into the corner. He's positioned up on that turnbuckle. Ooh! You know what, guys? I was afraid it was going to get to this point. Top rope! Superplex! And he keeps his focus on an attack to that area. Out of the ring. What's his plan here? Thrown back in under the ropes. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Staggering to his feet, but he won't. Cena catches nothing but air. Look at this going right after the left arm. Gotta hurt. And what a reversal from Chad Gable. And Cena is firing up the crowd here. 
He's doing a whole lot of gesturing, and it could cost him. He's certainly lining him up, but he's wasting too much time. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. And it's a long way down from there. And Cena finds himself on the wrist. Uh-oh, answered with a shot right to the face. Locks in the gut wrench. Suplex! If this works, it could change the course of the match. And his eyes are piercing through the opposition now. Uh-oh, monkey flip. <laughs> I love it. And Cena is in command. Cena's having it way. Getting up, but doesn't have a clue what's coming at him. Launching the top of a diving hammer strike. Cena up the turnbuckles. He's got the target acquired. Just a matter of moments. Cena. A diving leg drop by Cena. Fortune favors the bold. These risks could be a winning strategy. DDT. Hooked up. Oh, what a DDT. Staring back to his feet, but he might not know where he is. Oh, what a crash. And Gable digging deep, fighting in some late fire. Yeah, things are getting very dangerous for Cena. Rolling into a monkey flip. Over and over, repeated waistlock takedowns. Cena is unable to stop this string of offense. Cena's perseverance being tested. Lands the elbow. In full control here. Face full of turnbuckle. Elusiveness from Gable. Uh-oh, monkey flip. <laughs> I love it. Oh, oh, look at the well-placed elbow right on the mark. Oh, that might have just broken something. Cena ducks underneath. Couple of shoulder tackles now. Cena, the powerhouse. Gonna finish things up with a slam. Cena's bringing out his full arsenal. Cena is certainly getting that fierce look in his eyes. Cena showing he can still get the job done. Not just get it done, Saxton. Get it done with a... And powers it up. Uh -oh. Turns it around with an inverted DDT. Beautiful gator roll. Great way to disorient your opponent. No quarter being given by either competitor. You have to believe this one's going to be decided by the smallest of margins. Cena still divisive as ever with the WWE Universe, but you can't deny his legacy. Placed in the corner. Setting him up for something here. What more can this superstar do? Reaching deep into the arsenal. This could end the entire match from the top floor. Stumbling to his feet. Cena powers him up. Two oh, adjustment. Is that going to decide it for Cena? And got the win. That is a huge win here tonight. Here is your winner, the greatest of all time, John Cena. Gable is unable to pass the test tonight. And if Gable has anything to complain about tonight, someone should just tell him, shoot!